hope you are doing well today we will create this unique fruit basket design with the help of the solidworks and if you did not watch my tutorial about the design of a fruit basket that is designed in the other way you can also watch that tutorial i will provide link in the description or at the above corner so let's start today's tutorial from here i will select the front plane make it normal i will sketch a center rectangle here of dimension 5 and the 20 this dimension is 5 and this length is 20 press ok from here and select features select extrude boss or base here i will select the offset because i need an offset here and uh, from here select mid plane and i will give this value as 10 mm press ok now i will select the top plane make it normal and here sketch this one and uh, i will draw a center line here and uh, make a line i will give this dimension as 4 mm press ok now i need two circles here this one and this one will give this dimension as 100 press ok and uh, this dimension as 25 mm press ok and uh, we'll select this circle and this point and press control button from the keyboard and make a relation coincident here and delete the extra part that is not required i will trim this the part that is not required for me press ok from features i will select revolve boss or base and will select this line that is already selected and unmerge unselect the merge results from here press ok now i will select the combine command here so that i can select the common part from here press ok now this has been created now i will select the fillet and give this edge and this edge a radius of 2 mm press ok now i will select the front plane make it normal and sketch the front plane and draw center line here like this one and this one now from direct editing I will first exit this sketch and from direct editing I will select move or copy bodies I will select this body and number of patterns here are 6 I will rotate this along this line and will give this value as 10 degree press ok now I will again select move or copy bodies and select this body and from here i will select only one and uh, will rotate this along this one and will give this value as 5 degree so that it looks like here press ok now i will again select move or copy bodies from here and i will select this body and from here I will unselect this copy because I don't require this body here and from here I will select this line and will give this value as 10 degree press ok and will, it will shift here like this and here I will again select move or copy bodies I will select this one and here I need this body also so I check this copy and will give this value as 6 and here i will select this line and will give this value as 10 degree press ok from here now 
I will combine all these bodies from here and add these all bodies press ok now I will select circular pattern from here will select this line as the direction and uh, from bodies I will select this one and number of patterns are 16 and press ok from here now I will again combine all these bodies from here and uh, I will add all these bodies press ok now I will select the right plane and make it normal and will sketch a center rectangle here and will give this dimension as 5 mm press ok and exit this sketch and from features I will select the split line and here I will select this sketch and here I will select this surface and make single direction press ok now it has been split here and from surfaces I will select the knit surface and will select this one and press ok now I will hide this part and from surfaces I will select the filled surface and will fill all these parts press ok similarly this one now I will select from here the reference points curve and select this point and this point press ok similarly here curve through reference points select this point and this one press ok and here also press ok and here and it will be filled press ok now I will fill these parts and select filled surface and select this one this one this one and this one now it has been filled press ok similarly here press ok now it has been filled in the similar way press ok now I will just knit all the surfaces here and I will select all this and press ok and here I will give thickness to this surface of 2.5 press ok and from here I will just select the delete face and here I will select delete and patch select this one this face this face this this similarly this one this one and here this one and from here this
now press ok it has been removed i will give fillet here in order to remove the sharpness of these edges and i will give this value as 1.5 press ok and now it looks better now i will use the circular pattern here and will use this line as the direction and from bodies i will select this one and select the number of entities are 16 press ok and from here i will show our body that we hide now it looks better now i will again combine all these bodies and press ok here now i will save this now it has been combined and i will just select the front plane make it normal from sketch i will select a corner rectangle here and will give this dimension as from origin to this line 2.5 press ok or I will choose this as 2 and from features I will use the extrude cut and from here I will use mid plane and will give this value as 120 so that it will remove all our extra part from here similarly I again choose the front plane make it normal and sketch a corner rectangle here again at the bottom and we'll give this dimension from this origin to this line as 48 press ok and again i will use the extrude cut and we'll select mid plane from here and press ok now extra part has been removed from the bottom and i will add a plane here and second reference point as the top plane and press ok here i will draw a circle and will give this value as 102 mm press ok and here i will select the front plane make it normal and sketch the front plane here and draw a hexagonal shape and will give this dimension as 3 first i will make relation of horizontal here and will give this dimension as 3 press ok i will add a circle here and from here i will again give this dimension as 3 and use the trim press ok now i will select all this part and make it construction select this one and make it a geometry line now i will select the circular pattern from here and will select the parameter as this point and the entries to be patterned 
this arc and will give this value as 6 because we require 6 number of patterns press ok now just select this point and this circle make pairs here and from here select ok from features select sweep boss or base and i am selecting this one and the path that it follows will be this circle and from options i will use specify twist value from here will choose revolutions and will give this dimension as 6 now press ok now it looks better and similarly i add a plane in the bottom and we'll select this point and from here second reference point as the top plane make it and press ok from sketch i will select this plane and here i will draw a circle of dia 50 like this press ok from features i will select the extrude boss or base from here i will choose this value as 2.5 press ok and direction 2 as 7 point or i will just select the 7 and uh, here i will use to draft outward and here i will choose draft 2 degree press ok and from here i will hide these planes and will give a shell value here of 5 mm press ok now i will just use the chamfer here in order to give chamfer here of 2.5 press ok now our model has been created i will just hide this part and uh, will give appearance to our fruit basket now it looks better that was all about today's tutorial and if you did not subscribe my channel then subscribe it so that we will meet with a new project or in a new exercise